Hi, today I'm demonstrating the next step in my Project 65 8-bit breadboard-based computer. This is the first time that I've gotten this computer to run an actual piece of software, and I wanted to walk through a little bit about how it's put together and what it's doing. Over here is my CPU, which is a 6502 like you would find in an Apple II or Commodore VIC-20. And over here is an 8 kilobyte EEPROM, which is going to store the actual program. Tucked in between the two, this little silver box is a 4 megahertz oscillator, and that's what's providing the clock signal for the CPU. And of course we have a big red reset button over here, and a power supply up here. The program that this is running is pretty trivial. I've got two blocks of code located at different locations in memory in the EEPROM, and the software just runs one block of code, then jumps to the other block of code, executes it, and then jumps back to the first block, and so on. I've hooked up an LED to one of the address lines of the 6502. That way, as the processor jumps from one block of code to the other, the LED goes on and off. And right now, that's the only way that this computer can communicate with the outside world. There's still no RAM and no real I.O., but with a program actually running, this is a big first step towards making a functioning 8-bit computer. And you can find more details at my blog. You can find the link below. Thanks for watching.